Hi, in this video we'll learn how to divide the fractions. So there are three simple steps to divide the fractions. The first thing what we need to do is we need to convert this division problem into a multiplication problem and turn the second fraction upside down. Then the second step is to multiply both the fractions and the third step is to simplify the fraction if needed. So let's first convert this division problem into a multiplication problem. So you don't change the first fraction at all. So this will be 5 eighths. You change the division sign into the multiplication sign. And then you turn the second fraction upside down. That means you flip it. So 2 thirds becomes 3 halves. You're done with the first step. Now the second step is you multiply both the fractions. So let's multiply them. 5 times 3 will be 15. 8 times 2 would be 16. We're done multiplying the fractions. Now the last step is simplify the fraction if needed. Now if you see, this is a proper fraction because the numerator is smaller than the denominator and we cannot reduce this fraction at all. So our final answer would be 15 over 16. Now let's see this example. So again, we need to do, we need to divide the fraction in three simple steps, right? The first step is we convert the division problem into a multiplication problem. We don't change the first fraction at all. We change the division sign to a multiplication sign. And then we turn the second fraction upside down. That means we just flip it. So the denominator becomes the numerator and the numerator becomes the denominator. So three six becomes six over three. We're done with the first step. The second step is to multiply both the fractions. So now we're gonna multiply two and six, two times six is 12. And then three times three is nine. We're done with the second step. We multiplied the fractions. Now the third and the final step is simplify the fraction if needed. Now if you see this is an improper fraction, we'll need to convert this into a proper fraction. But before doing that, we can reduce the fraction. So 12 over nine, well, I can reduce this fraction by dividing the top and bottom by three. So I'm gonna divide the numerator and the denominator by three. 12 divided by three will give me four and nine divided by three will give me three. So again, we got an improper fraction. We need to convert this into a mixed fraction. So we can do that by using long division method. Three will go into four one time. Three times one is three. The remainder is one. Now, the final answer would be, we just need to write this in the form of mixed fraction. So we write the quotient first. That becomes my whole part. And the remainder and divisor will be my fractional part. So the remainder goes on the top and the divisor goes in the bottom. So the final answer would be one and one thirds. That's all in this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you are new to this channel and want to see more videos on other math topics, be sure to subscribe down below and share it with your friends. See you in next video.